840 News Talk Saga 960 Raw, Mike Richards. And as you know, from time to time, our good friends at Bell Lifestyle Products, the sponsors of the show, the sponsors of the studio. And of course, uh, we have this conversation with a, a lot of their people here this morning. Now, uh, Julie's going to be joining us in just a sec. I think she has to just click on her camera, which again, when you do it for the first time, I mean, people talk about COVID. What is the influence of COVID? It's Zoom. <laughs> I never <laughs> even heard. I didn't even heard of Zoom. What's Zoom? What is it? The magic trick? Now I, you know, it's funny. And then and and then Skype, which was the thing that I had heard of. Who uses that? What uh, what 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 cave dwelling people are using Skype? Because apparently no one uses it anymore. It Zoom is the way, and and thank goodness because uh, because of it. Julie Beaver is joining us here this morning, I believe, from the fabulous Welland. Is that correct, Julie? Yes, it is. Well, look at that, Brendan. You have a you have a what St. Catharines for you, Brendan? No, oh, no, I lived in Welland. Oh, cool. Yes. Well, I went to Niagara College. So I lived, Oh nice. Uh, yeah. So did I. <laughs> oh, okay. There we go. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Did you date? I'm just throwing nope. that in. I just, I'm just curious. I think uh, this would be very awkward for everyone. But uh, no, you did not. <laughs> uh, but you have uh, joined us here this morning and are good friends at Bell. And we talk about a lot of different products, uh, which do a world of good. It's uh, Julie, it was something that uh, years ago when I was approached uh, by Bell, I no, natural health products would not be something that would have been anything that I would have mm -hmm. thought of, you know. And now that I've come to understand it, come to know it it is so vital what happens actually on a daily basis for this family and we've all done so well and yeah. when it comes to the topic of brain as i said those that have listened to the show for years know that uh, i have not been doing the right things because <laughs> apparently there's a shortage on that side so when it comes to brain function what are we talking about here this morning julie okay well brain function or cognitive functioning that kind of refers to multiple abilities things like learning thinking reasoning remembering that's a big one problem solving decision making our attention span this is all cognitive functioning or brain healthy uh things that we need to do with our brain and i would think in all seriousness and anyone who's had a grandparent or someone in the family where you know you've seen dementia alzheimer's mm -hmm. those sort of things people including myself if you don't have the recall that you used to, or you think that there's a bit of a fog or mm -hmm. look, some of those things are due to aging, but there are certain issues, I suppose, that you can actually help yourself with from, from, from a health program. And I guess that's what we're going to talk about this morning, because most people just think, yeah, ah, that's the way it goes. There's nothing we can do about it. That's never the way it is. You can always be sort of um, involved in your own health. Uh, you, you literally have to be these days. You don't get that same one-on-one -on -one doctor time where you could go in and speak about everything going on. So you have to kind of be in charge of your own health. And there's a lot of things that we can do to improve. Even if we're not doing it now, we can start. It's never too late. So when it comes to things like improving your cognitive function, mm -hmm. so so where do we start? What are we talking about here this morning? Okay. Uh, I, I do a radio show as well. And the one thing I always talk about with any condition, disease, prevention, is your food. What goes in makes a huge difference. So things like a high plant-based diet, rich in fruits and vegetables, lots of colors, uh, leafy greens. I'm a big um, promoter of good healthy fats as well. Mm -hmm. Things like omega-3, your fish, your flax, your hemp oils for that's the um, really good starting base. Okay. So, so when people start talking about fish in their diet, mm -hmm. so that contains a lot of different things. But of course, there's also supplements, which of course, uh, Bell yes. Lifestyle Products has that as well. Absolutely. But but why is that so important, those kinds of fats or what's in omega-3s? Why, why is that uh, connected to things uh, with brain issues, for instance? Why, why do we take that? Okay, excellent question. Um, so omega-3s is one of the, the key fats, and I'm glad you mentioned that because not all fish has it. And exactly supplements are really how people can be consistent so i highly recommend an omega-3 supplement um, omega-3 contains epa 
EPA is known as an acid that helps control inflammation. So EPA can control inflammation in our brain as well as throughout the body. It also contains something called DHA. And DHA, we know from birth to senior citizen, is the fat that helps our brain. It's the fat that helps us develop our brain, and it really will help us deal with memory as well. Well, th th this is a main focus, quite frankly, mm -hmm. of, of of our society today. And, and, you know, as much as, you know, we've grown up with being afraid of, of cancer, and I'm mm -hmm. someone who uh, is a survivor of cancer, so I understand what it's like to be told that you have cancer. Mm -hmm. But the reality is, and this is talking to, to doctors and, and surgeons over the years, uh, being in the media industry, guys from Mount Sinai in New York City, and just you go on and on and on, that we've understood now that it is the brain function. It is functions of the brain and then the diseases that come with it and the, 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 what happens to us as a society when we start thinking about these issues. Mm -hmm. That is more of our, we will be more afraid in this current world of things like dementia, Alzheimer's, than we probably have can't because there's, a, there's been so much done towards cancer prevention. Yeah that I think the focus really is on the brain. So when you start talking about memory, when you start talking about uh, brain health, I would say 20 years ago, you, people might roll their eyes, but for sure, not now, Julie, not now. No, because now we're seeing it happen to younger and younger people. It used to be dementia. We only recognize or seen in, say, our 80-year-old grandparents. And, and, and we often thought that's normal, right? They're aging. Um, but rates are expected to soar. Dementia rates from now till 2050 are supposed to just soar. As it is right now, 570,000 Canadians are dealing with dementia. It's costing Canadians over $10 billion to treat it. And that, again, that's just expected to soar in the next couple of years. So we have to do better like we have with cancer on the prevention and on the things that we can do to control. That's a great point. And because that's what we're, that's really what we're talking about here this morning is prevention. Yeah. And, and, and for those listening going, so, okay, so what do I do? What can I possibly take? And I know that Bell has number 36. Mm -hmm. so of course, we go by the numbers, which makes it so much easier <laughs> for the consumers. Like, just give me the 36, but brain function. So what does it do? Why is that helping us? Okay. So brain function is a formula that Bell put together to help enhance cognitive functioning in adults. It supports the brain health. It helps to um, enhance memory. It's a unique combination of herbs, vitamins, amino acids, um, prevention of folic acid deficiency or folate deficiency. It's a really well-rounded, put-together formula because face it, a lot of us, um, we want things that are easy. We've got busy lifestyles. So it's not like we're going to take a handful of supplements. So we need to get these things that are all put together for us so that you know we, we can get on with our busy life and just deal with a single easy to take well and it's 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 very often in these conversations we have uh, on a monday mm -hmm. where we talk about we do talk about diet things that you can have that are going to help you naturally yeah. but sometimes to get the amount of what we're talking about it would take forever for instance to have uh some of these things that we're talking about as a supplement which mm -hmm. is why we take supplements in our busy lives because you can't sit around and have 20 buckets of yogurt or whatever yeah. it, it, we, it's just impossible to eat that much fish or whatever mm -hmm. it happens to be that's why bell puts these supplements out there so um you know the one thing that we do talk about all the time is is the balance so we talk about nutrition we talk about what these supplements mm -hmm. do but the other thing uh, julie when it comes to the brain some of the things we don't talk about it real simple things like sleep habits sleep oh absolutely the importance of sleep yep Sleep hygiene is important for every aspect of your life. If you don't have a good sleep pattern, oh, your adrenal glands will cease to function properly. Our stress goes really, really high. Um, but yeah, we have to maintain good sleeping habits to heal and repair. And if we don't do that, we're sort of always in this sort of negative I'm always surprised too, and, and, and I can't help it, but you know, in a lot of these uh, properties that, that, that Bell has, Mm -hmm. There's stuff in there that I don't associate with, you know, because I'm, well, I'm an idiot. So <laughs> when I see rosemary, I'm like, oh, the stuff you put on chicken. Yeah, yeah. well, that is true. But when you start talking about uh, ginkgo and, and, and magnesium and some of the stuff that's in brain function, it has 
a medicinal purpose. It has a health purpose to it. And I'm always amazed that what goes into some of these products. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm, I'm glad you mentioned some of the ingredients because yeah, it, it's amazing. And you mentioned rosemary on chicken. I like it, but do I want to eat that every meal every day? No, I really do not. I like it a little bit on potato, a little bit on chicken. Um, but recent studies do show that um, rosemary significantly enhances the quality of memory and the increased mental alertness the memory speed which a lot of us suffer from it's like okay i know it's there but it's just not coming so rosemary is is um actually being studied and and in supplemental form as well as essential oil form so for me i'm never consistent enough with things like putting the essential oil on or putting it in the food so that's why in the function formula the rosemary it's you're getting a consistent supply of it and that's important what else is in there as I look down at all these uh, ingredients? Because there, there's a lot. And and as I said, it is kind of genius the way that they have mm -hmm. put these things together. Because as, as when uh, Doug Carey comes on, he talks about the process going from the stage of what they might want to do to the actual product being available to people. There's a rigorous routine they have to do, including, uh, you know, the governmental uh, requirements. And it might take two years from beginning to end. So uh, this is mm -hmm. not something they just whip up and then put it on the shelves. There is a there's a stringent way that this gets to us as the public. But there's a lot of ingredients in here that uh, I think are interesting that they have put together in this product. OK, yeah, it's a good point. Um, it takes a lot, especially in Canada. We have some of the strictest, strongest um, uh, measures. And this is a good thing, which means every time we buy a product that has a regulation number in Canada, we're guaranteed to get what's on that label. So it's a good thing. Uh, some of the other ingredients are going to be things like ginkgo biloba. A lot of us know and have heard of ginkgo for memory. This seems to help with peripheral circulation, blood flow to the brain. An exciting ingredient in there is lecithin. Um, so many of us are picking on the mighty egg still, but eggs and lecithin are full of things like choline. Choline is so important for our brain. It's just one of the best nutrients for brain health. So uh, face it, it's not something people are getting in the diet. So supplementation is um, a guarantee to get a good quality form of lecithin. Now, some of this stuff like... Uh... Uprzia serrata? Am I just sounds like uh, someone I met in Romania? I have no <laughs> idea. What I, just, I have no idea what I just said. What did I say? Uh, yeah, it's that's one a, a really funny one. It's we're looking for something called huperzine A, and this maintains adequate levels of the brain chemical acetylcholine. So there you see that choline again is very very important for brain health, memory, learning. And we've heard of vitamin B12, but maybe we don't know exactly what that does. Oh, it does so much in the body. Uh, B12, folic acid, folic acid, that combination protects us from homocysteine. So we're going to look at things like brain health, heart health. Uh, both are, are essential for our immune system and red blood cell formation. So these nutrients are vitally important for just everybody but particularly for our aging brain yeah which is again uh, in talking with uh, julie here this morning is just so important and really is top of mind i know it is uh, in in my family where grandparents uh, have had uh, issues with dementia sometimes alzheimer's just anything mm -hmm. that is the the degeneration of, of what happens to the brain and it is certainly a very uh, topical um, uh, conversation that families are having yeah. right now in, in greater numbers than they ever did. So I appreciate uh, appreciate you coming on here this morning. Now, by the way, mm -hmm. uh, in talking to Julie Beaver, Julie is also, I believe you're the manager at HealthWise. That is in right in Welland? Yes, it is. Yeah. We're located in the Seaway Mall in Welland. And uh, yeah, we've been here for over 30 years. Oh, wow. That's yeah. awesome. Now, Brendan, have you ever gone in there? Have you like legitimately gone in there or have you ever stolen anything from there? Might as well, that's <laughs> might as well come clean now. I have I've not been in the store. I've been in the Seaway Mall many times, but I have not uh, I've not I've not stopped by this store yet. Well, there you go. It's time to stop by and, right. and go see Julie. Did a wonderful job here this morning, Julie. That was uh, really you. nice to talk with you. I'm sure we'll do it again. Uh, these are important issues. And this morning, just so people know, that is number 
36 brain function, what we're talking about. So take care, Julie, and hopefully people will stop by and see you in Welland. And I really appreciate you uh, joining us here this morning. Thanks for having me. Take that care. Is Julie Beaver joining us here. Uh, once again, that's, that is uh, health-wise in Welland. Uh, and the topic this morning is the brain function number 36 from Bell Lifestyle Products. Really important stuff and uh, vital information, really, when you think about what we're talking about these days. Uh, so mm -hmm. stop by and uh, pick up a bottle.